have some lacrosse training going on over here um, with SportsMate Personal, one of our, our bus uh, business partners. SportsMate Personal, I see three athletes here. Yes. It's more of a group setting here? Yes, they do uh, private and small group instruction. Got it. But when we move Training with uh, Bill Campbell, he's a former major leaguer, and uh, this is Chad Rebecca, plays for a Lake County Fielders, and he's doing hitting training right now, and he also does fielding training. How does this improve the kick game? Oh, it, it really works on repetition. Um, exactly what you got to do to get better, um, you know, from game to game, practice to practice. So he'll do uh, instruction with them, and then he'll give them a maintenance program to do in-between instruction. Really? train like crazy, morning, yes. noon, and night, if they want to make it yes. to the Olympic circle, if you, if you will. Absolutely. Olympic circuit, if you will. Yes. So they can rent the space from you. Yes. Um, Irina is just a tremendous instructor, and, and we love having the rhythmic gymnastics girls here. Group setting, but are these all kids from different schools that come over to get trained? Absolutely. They're not part of the same team? Not at all. We have St. Viators, Stevenson, Prospects, all Presented here today. Um, there are high school kids that are looking to improve in the off season and you know get better and get an edge for making their team. But this is uh, skills. But what we work on is the skills to get them better. So it could be their offensive skills, it could be their defensive skills, shooting, rebounding, dribbling, whatever it takes. So we work on their skill development and, and the continuous improvement process. Exactly. <laughs> Thank you. Exactly. Well, she's having fun. Let's check it out. Anna is at a special training center for student athletes. Hey, Anna. Hey, good morning. How cool would it be if a former Bears player could train you? Well, Marcus Robinson right here can do it. Good morning, Marcus. Good morning. How are you doing? I'm doing great. So good. now you're doing personal training? Yeah, I do a little bit of personal training. It's called sports cardio for adults. So what we do is everything I learned for 10 years playing NFL to stay in shape, I put everybody else through. We just do it on a small scale. By pushing a tire back and forth? Man, we push tires. We do medicine ball throws. We do squats. I mean, that is really hard. I've done that. It is really hard, but it's a total body workout. You got to squat down, pick up the tire, and push it over. So it's definitely a cardio thing, and it's muscle wise. Yeah, I'm Buffalo Grove, and I'm here with former Bears player Marcus Robinson. Good morning. Good morning. So these girls are playing basketball, but you have trained them in speed and agility. Yes, I have. Just it's fundamental all of it. Basically, you're teaching kids to use their left foot as well as their right. So it works in all different sports, and it's it's going pretty well for them. Matt training center. What high school? Exactly. You're training now because this is the future of a pro sport right yes, here, right? Yes, it is. Here we go. What we do is basically put this in agility. You're trying to teach the right foot with the left foot. Right now they're doing chops. The feet are always moving. Here you go. Ready? Go point. Touch over. Get back. It's just toe touching. Basically, go. They're watching me and they're reacting. A lot of okay. putting this in agility is reaction. Go. And that's what they're doing right here. So, so you were saying it's not really cardio. It's go. more... Yeah, it's more learning. It's more equipment and agility is learning. It's not cardio you just run through something and get tired. How about so the ladies back there? The ladies back here, they got ball over here. Basically, we call these choo-choos. So choo-choos are as quick as your feet can go back and forth. The most important thing is the ball's over here, they have to use their legs. Your hip flexors is the key. You got to use the hip flexors to raise to push your feet back and forth. Okay. So that's what we work right here. Mm -hmm. Right here. Now push it up so with your left. Oh. That little bitty thing right there is a big difference. That can really trip me up. He's one of the stars. He's a basketball player, point guard for him, Michael Tulip. Basically right here, he's just doing squat jump. We're working on his calves, working on his quads right now. He's just jumping up and down on the big tire right here. We do flip this tire as well, so he really does get a real good workout. I know. Marcus, it was great meeting you. Thank you. Thank you so much.